this is stage 5, of course. And this is probably one of the most important times to have the plasma gun, simply because if you edge yourself close enough, these guys shooting lasers cannot even fucking touch you. You just have to shoot them through the walls, that's all. Those little orange cubes, though, you cannot shoot them through, so you gotta, gotta time it right. And that guy on the far right there, that laser shooter is a piece of shit, because you're gonna usually be jumping, you're gonna hit him, but it doesn't matter. Because I got my additional hit, I am fucking ready. This level ain't nothing. And up there's a C, and I want to show it off. And be careful, because when you switch gravity, they will follow you. Don't fucking think they won't. And I'm not going to get that shield. I don't care enough. Maybe the shield can deflect the lasers, too. Oh, yeah, and there is something special about the next part of level 5. This wall. Fuck that. You can't shoot it, obviously. You're not gonna die from it if you're fucking... If you're moving at all, it's not gonna touch you. Oh, and these little blue guys shoot lasers at you. Just avoid them, because if you shoot them, that happens. But they're easy. And this part is the problem. This would be the big problem if I didn't have the plasma gun. Because, you gotta shoot that guy through the wall. And I thought I could get the one below me, but I guess not. I haven't played this game in a while, I guess, because I thought I could fucking get him. And let me see, can I get him? There we go. Yeah, I knew I could get that guy. And this part is actually kind of a pain in the ass because you can't get those two guys. Oh, found. Yeah, I thought I kind of fucked with the gravity there because I thought I I didn't think I could make it. Of course I couldn't. But anyway, we're at this boss. I would actually say he's probably the hardest boss, at least in my opinion. He turns from blue to red. In blue he'll shoot diagonal lasers, and this in red he'll shoot vertical lasers and god damn it. Whatever. I got an extra life for that reason, so I can lose it. But that's alright, I can live with that. But anyway, yeah, he turned blue. I guess his name's R seventy five or something. His red form, I'd say, is probably the second hard. I think the blue form is the hardest to avoid his attack, but then I don't really know. This is green form, I died before I got to it, and this is the easiest to avoid, because you just switch the gravity, or you duck, or whatever. It doesn't matter, like, and now he's going fucking nuts. <sighs> he shoots two of whatever he had been shooting, and I don't know. Like, once you get him here, all you think is, alright, we're about done, and then you get excited, because I'm even jumping for joy. But that's enough of stage 5, because it's time for some stage 6 action. What could be hard in stage 5? Oh no, oh my god. There's, oh yeah, these, these fire guys. Nothing. This, however, is the level where the infinitely looping thing kind of fucks you over. And I'm careful here, because I know there's a laser shooter, and I wasn't positive where, but I didn't want him to fucking hit me, because he always hits me. This is a spot you could potentially want a shield, but I still want a plasma gun, because fuck the shield weapon. And these blue guys come out of nowhere. Bullshit. Not really. And you'll notice that the bullets kind of come out of the bottom of the screen. You can use that if you want to. Now here's the toughest level to me. Oh, I got an additional hit, so I guess that won't be so tough, right? Wrong. Probably. I don't know. Anyways, you just have to be careful here. I, I wasn't just being an asshole going up and down. I was actually trying to hit one of those laser shooters. And you gotta be careful with the fire spitters. They're a pain in the ass. But you wanna get rid of as many enemies as you can, that's really it. This part isn't so bad. You just have to stick up or bot or top or bottom, and then you don't have to shoot the ones on the bottom, but you should. Just in case. It's not gonna hurt you if you do that. Now this spot, I, I'm not really sure what to do here, and, oh, there you go, there you go, you have to, it's, it's kind of a, it is, this is a puzzle section to me, and you gotta be careful flipping gravity or you'll land on those spikes, but now I got an extra hit, 
This boss could, I guess, be considered harder than the last one, because those floors, top and bottom, will kill you if you touch them. And what you have to do is hit these platforms, you hit the brown part that's exposed, it's very rarely exposed, so you gotta have an eye out, and you might notice, since you're standing on, okay, they turn red, and when they turn red, about like one more hit will kill them. So the best way to do this is to hit them one, two, and then when you're standing on the last one, shoot down. You just have to be careful, make sure you know what's underneath you at all times. That's... that's as simple as I can make it. But now, we're at the last level, stage seven. This is kind of a short game for being so awesome. And it gives you the option, you can get a shield. I probably... I, I'm not going to, but I probably... Ah, oh, fuck, who cares. I don't know, I got plasma, I only want plasma. I don't know why, but anyway, yeah, now we're at the boss gauntlet, and this guy is piss easy as ever. I, you know what, I should have showed off the shield weapon, I'm sorry. Fucking, you know what, who cares? No, no one wants, no one's gonna use the shield weapon, because it sucks. Fuck it, whatever. On to the next boss. These pieces of garbage, I've had enough of them. Like, what, a, no, these guys, I don't know, this feels like it was a while back that I bought them, so. This is appropriate. Fighting these little blue dragon laser faces ain't so bad. When there's only one of them left, there's like no challenge. You're not gonna get hit by one of them. Cause you can just jump. I don't, I don't get it. Now we're on to the stage 3 boss, who I think I actually kinda got a better strategy for. Which is to just overthink it and dodge him, dodge the late two sets of lasers, and I fucking, there's how my strategy treats me. God, ugh. I don't know how I figured that the lasers might to avoid twice, I don't know. It worked, I didn't get hit, I don't care. Whatever. And here's the pussy bot 5000, oh man, what a toughie. Fuck this guy, and just get- whoa, 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 whoa. That was his revenge on me, I suppose, where he almost hit me. This guy sucks so bad, his revenge on me would be to almost hit me. What a piece of shit. Whatever. He's- he's done for forever. Now R75 is back, I'm fucking- I don't want it- this is the problem, though. I feel like I just fought this guy. Because the stages aren't super long. So, I don't I don't know. I like the boss gauntlet idea, but it also feels like I, I just did this. So why bother? I don't know. He's got me yawning. He's so boring. Jesus Christ. Ugh. And then the... I don't know. I, I think I got better at this guy. Probably gonna hit me and prove me wrong, but I don't know. Maybe it's just because the green set is. You know, actually, when I look at him again, I don't know if his his form changes are based on damage or if he just does them on a time basis. I think it's damage, but I can't be positive. Well, it doesn't matter now because he's fucking broken down. Fuck him. And yes, we're still not done. We still have another boss. This guy again. I don't know. I, you know what? I guess a boss gauntlet isn't complete without all the bosses. So whatever. Fighting all the bosses in a row again. Jeez, I didn't know I was playing Capcom's Mega Man 7. <laughs> yeah, well that's enough for this guy. Okay, now he's open. Jump, jump, shoot. That, that guy did give me some trouble when I first played this, so I mean, obviously, he's not easy. You just gotta time it. And now after all that, we got one final boss. That was fucking pathetic. Oh well, that was the last boss. We're done. We've completed the mission. Congratulations.
fuck? I got immortality, I guess. That's cool by me. That's that's cool. Don't even have to worry about dying anymore. And I don't think I'll be doing this, but we'll see. 